One, two, three. One, two, three. All right. Oh, wow, it's only on 25. Oh, yeah, never mind. Hey everybody, the Reese here, and welcome back to more of Pia Sola and the Grey Architects. Okay, what was I doing? <laughs> oh yeah, just before I started recording I healed everybody up. Um, just using crawlers. Wait, what, what did you say? We'll go to the School of Mystics, but we must find it first. Okay. We need to get the hell out of here first. I mean, the only other place we could go to was the mine, but we couldn't leave because there was a person blocking our path that would literally just tell you, hard work. Wait, are them footprints new? Hold on, man. Oh god, how did I do this last time? I think I just had two people attack. Wait, red ball, blue ball. Oh no, he goes for a different one. That's right. There, perfect. Also, I completely forgot. Oh no, he got put to sleep. Yeah, whatever. No, I completely forgot. Um, at the end of the last session, <clears throat> one thing I said, because I noticed that my like frames and everything was like went to shit essentially, and basically I ended up saying uh, that I really hoped it didn't split the stream into multiple files. It did. It split my stream into into two separate um, broadcasts, which sucks. Because it meant I had to upload the raw file so that the full f the full thing was available. I don't have to do it, but I like to. It just kind of gives me peace of mind. But the downside is, because of that, it took two hours in total because I had to upload it to YouTube and to Twitch. It's only the only issue when stuff like that fucks up. <clears throat> if it hadn't actually created two separate broadcasts and instead had just you know, gone to, like, very low frame rate or very low quality for a few seconds or whatever. I'd have much preferred that. Oh, right, yeah, that's where we came from. But no, of course, it, it ended up just completely doing what I didn't want to happen. Just kind of sucked, really. Oh, never mind. Actually. Screw it. Go for the spider eggs first. But it... The result of it was basically that I didn't get to do as much yesterday as I, as I would have liked. However, that wasn't entirely the stream screwing up's fault. It was also because the weather was terrible. The weather, the weather, blah, weather wasn't exactly bad, but it was incredibly windy. And the downside to it being super windy is it crashes against my window and makes a lot of noise. So it's like, even if I wanted to record, I probably wouldn't have been able to. I mean, I would have, but it, I would have got really annoyed just at the wind banging against my window. Because I kind of like to have... I don't really know. When I have little things like that in my audio, it really bugs me. Um... Right. I don't even know what the hell will be at. It'll be fine. But yeah, because of the weather being terrible and also having to upload the stream twice, or to two separate sites, resulted in not being able to record as much, which kind of sucked, but fingers crossed. I don't know what caused the um, stream issue though. Like knock on wood, everything's alright. I mean I've streamed two? No, three things. No, two things today. I've done a session of Ace Attorney Investigations and Rogue Galaxy, and both of those were fine. But one thing I ended up doing was in OBS there's a setting to do with like networking and using a different networking code. I basically disabled that and um, fingers crossed. <laughs> That's all I can really hope. Bingo, someone has used it. Then let's move up quickly before someone notices us. This game has very odd performance. Um, what if it breaks again? That's right, we can't risk losing our only way out of here. What should we do then? I know, you go first, then if everything is okay, we go after you. Me? Why me? Well, you know, you're the heaviest. 
I'm not fat. What if she's sending our little Eddie into a trap? Don't be absurd. You can't possibly d distrust her now. Besides, Edison is much more handy with machinery than we are. He may figure out a way to transport us safely. After this is over, we're going to have a long conversation. Alright, I'll go. But Lossa comes with me. Be careful, little brother. No, like, the game's performance isn't bad. It's just when the text comes up, sometimes it, like, freezes at a very specific point and then continues. It's very strange. There goes nothing. But no, the game performs perfectly. It's, it's very strange. Alright, I'm safe. I'm here safe. I'm sending it back down to you. Or for you. Bum, ba, bum. Going up. Can I not go into this room? Please? No! Hey, we're safe. Thanks, Lassa. You're my lucky charm. He talks to it. Don't ask. Shh. Keep your voices down. We're not exactly invited to guests. I want to get down to that. Fine. Guess I can't. Oh. <laughs> what is this? Hold up. Oh. I got a potion. Was not expecting that to result in, you know, actually getting something. Random rope. Alright, well, I'm out of here. Bum, ba, bum. Right, well, my thing's not going crazy. Yeah, no. As in, like, my, my radar's not beeping. Oh, they're not ropes, they're pipes. Okay, I'm an idiot. Oh, the enemies are the same. Yay! Um blue ball on the other one. And there we go. That should be enough to kill them. No, he's asleep. Damn it. We really like to go for hostage. Oh my god. Ha! Oh. Well, okay. That was unexpected. Crawler just managed to one-shot a spider egg. Doesn't he have, like, insanely high power, though? Or is it Hostin that does? I can't remember. Hey, level 26. Yeah, I really do not have a clue. Alright, heaven blow on Hostin. Fifty-nine. Yeah, he has seventy. He has more power than Edison, but his defense is terrible. Huh. Alright. Aha! Okay, never mind. God damn. This is I can get behind. Yeah, lots of amoebas. Just attack any... I mean, he could also attack whichever. I'll go for one that's not being attacked by everybody else, though. It just seems to be the best strategy. There's another. Oh! I mean, he does half damage to them regardless. So, that kind of sucks. Uh, don't really need to worry. We win! Well, the one thing I've noticed is the amoebas only seem to counter... Zellini out of everybody. I'm pretty sure Zellini's the only person they've actually countered. Strange. Hmm. I mean, nah, I don't really need to. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh god, this is another secret. I don't see anything. Ah! Back! Oh, well, we got advantage again. Do blue ball. There we go. Oh, wow. Okay, never mind. Was not expecting Edison to be able to one shot one. Hey, I mean, it happened. Oh, right, yeah, we can just do whatever now. Ba -ba -bum -ba -ba -bum. There we go. Very nice. Nice, level 27 and 28. 
Which means Alina's probably close. Where am I? Oh! Ah! Wow, they were like hidden chests. Sneaky bricks. And now I'm just highly doubting there's anything else. Apart from, you know, maybe more hidden corridors. Another advantage! Oh boy, I can get behind this. Yeah, quite arrow. Oh, you're st ah, no, 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 no. Go for the spider eggs first. No, 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 no. Alright, okay. I think. Here we go. Stun it. Damn it. Oh, I didn't kill it either. Crap. Oh, we did get advantage. Okay, I killed it. Oh, no. Well, he's gone for that one anyway. There we go. Very nice. You prick. Every time it's Zellini. There we go. So everybody's at least level 27. Not too shabby. What? Oh! What is this place? Oh my. Well, here we are, ladies and gentlemen. The Contina School of Magic. Are we allowed in? Good question. That's incredible. Is that the only entrance to the school? It is indeed. The first test of this place is just figuring out how to get in. I'm sure the owners of that bakery appreciated having someone cut a hole in their building. Those monsters? Who cares? Besides, I'm guessing they covered their tracks. Shh, someone's coming. Quick, hide. Where are we going? What the pfft? Holy crap! Oh! One, two, three. Trick no keys. It's three and six. Do I need to remember this? Think that'll work for us? We don't have any other option. So trick no keys. One, two, three. Oh, dusk no keys. Oh, we're in. I don't know how I managed to do that, but all right. The magic school. Oh boy. Hey, we don't have to worry about fights in here. They're very nice. Yeah, don't mind us, I'm just going to steal everything you've got. A towel? That's in a very apt place. Oh god, they're showering. <laughs> Figaro, Figaro! Oh god, we don't understand them. Oh great. This is going to be fun. Oh, oh cutscene. Who are you? Um, we're the new students. New students, huh? Then why aren't you wearing uniforms? Or your uniforms? Uh, they're being washed? Liars, you're intruders. I'll teleport you out of here now. Oh no! Now we're in the basement. Wait, what? What the heck? I'm just kind of confused. Sorry, I'm not going through all of that again. Although it wouldn't exactly have taken very long. Uh, I've just realised why there's a shower. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. Thankfully the door's open, so... Let's just go right on in. Yeah, if you go north, we're recognised as intrude. I see. Oh my god, how'd I miss this? Aha! Uh -huh. I know what to do. Let's dress these dress in these, and they'll think we're one of them. Uh, Crella, you realise these belong to someone, right? That I do, but my dear Hoster in desperate times call for desperate measures. And besides, what's the harm in giving some snobby prep school kid a lesson in humility? This is mean, but necessary, and kind of funny. Well, hurry up and grab him. 
so we can get the hell out of here. Well, oh my god, look at us. Yeah, they don't care. <laughs> Wait, why were there five uniforms? There's only three dudes showering. Oh, right, so now we won't be recognized as intruders. May I help you? Ah, uh, yes. We've just arrived. Have we missed orientation? Hey, that's not bad. Better than a lost uncle, huh? Orientation? That was last week. Hmm, we don't usually accept students this late. Never the matter. It's always different with mature students. I'll show you around. Are you a student as well? Uh, she's my wife. Why her? Oh, how lovely. Well then, follow me. <laughs> Why was Alina getting, uh, jealous? Oh god. <laughs> oh, he's covering up his, um, his Johnson too. Oh no! <laughs> uh, lesson in humility indeed. These are the main auditoriums. Most of your classes will be held here. The other wing houses the labs. And they can be interesting, I assure you. What a fancy place. Down this way, faculty's office. Mine is there. Oh, by the way, I'm Professor Meyer. Well, students, that's all. And don't forget to check out check our library. Of course, the lower levels are open to the public, but we also have a collection of rare manuscripts as well as student records in its upper uh, echelons. Every year we honor our top first years with a glimpse of our collection. The comp competition is fierce, though. Surely there are public viewings sometimes. <laughs> Absolutely not. We are a private institution and we protect what is ours. Of course, if you all study hard, you may just get to see what so few ever do. Seems a little self-serving to me. Well, yes, young minds are entitled to their opinions, erroneous as they may be. Anyway, children, I must bid you adieu. I hope your time here is stimulating, and you, sir. Me? It's so wonderful that someone of your era hasn't given up on intellectual development. I wish you luck. Take care, everyone. Oh, by the way, your uniforms are very messy. Did you wear them in a hurry? They must be tidy if you want to attend the... Uh, to the classes. Ta! Uh... Okay. Where's Edison going? At what point did he stop helping us and start making fun of us? My era? Alina, am I really that wrinkled? How's my skin? Your baby smooth skin is fine. Focus, guys, we have a problem. You think? All we have to do is get to the top of the class and we're in. Alina, how are your grades back home? Uh... Crawler? Well, I... Uh, I'll be in the library studying. Alright, we'll keep up the facade for now. Pretend we're students. We'll have to find... We'll have time to find what we need. Well, at least we already found these uniforms. I can't believe they expect us to wear these. Oh, come on, Nelly. You look kind of cute. Uh, really? What about me? You look like a doofus. Hey! <laughs> well, let's get to our dorms. Looks like we've got school in the morning. What? Do I really look cute in this? Oh my god. So now we're in like a... We're in the school? This is an interesting segment. <laughs> oh yeah! I got an apple! What do we have here? A young man with his feet steady on the ground, stable and rooted. Definitely an earth-based type. Then a woman with emotions deep as the ocean, and a soul that is always there. Yep, a water mistress. Third, a kid and a lady with passion stronger than steel and a heart of, you guessed it, fire. Too easy. Hmm. A man who, who turns as fast as the wind can only be one with it. Enough said. That's cool. Yeah, I like that. Not bad. I don't know why I like the explanation so much, but it was pretty cool. Oh, it's over in that room, it would appear. Can I get over to there? Oh, I can. Perfect. You better not stop me. This is mine. What the hell is that? A jock salad. Mm -hmm. Whoa. I wonder why this benefactor wants to drop the healing spells out of the program. Hmm. This is a cool part of the game, really. Although we have, like, enrolled in a school. Forcefully. We weren't exactly enrolled, we just kind of tagged along. And took some random school uniforms. Those guys will still be buck naked. Ah, oh, poor dudes. 
Berries! I'm busy right now, can you come back later? No, but I will talk to your students. I'm gonna create a spell that charms and charms of the brooms and mops Wait. Oh right. Charms the brooms and mops into cleaning on their own. That can really be helpful for failing students in this school. So much to write, so little time. Gonna have to drop quality to keep up with the necessary quantity. Yeah, that's definitely true. That was one thing in like lectures. Like having to make notes on everything, but everybody well not everybody, but some of the teachers spoke so fast. You had next to no time to actually make notes. Unless you literally just scribbled. And then you had to play a game later of deciphering what the fuck it is you wrote. So Barang Siapa Menkari Kari Tahu Apa Artinia Ini Sebenanya Suda ter Terlalu Banyak Waktu Pada Kedua Tanganya I'm doing sorcery, please don't disturb me. Oh. <laughs> Makes sense. Wait, how did I get in here? Oh, there we go. Right. Oh. Aha. Mana potion plus. We magic users are rightfully higher than those who don't cast spells. Being a wizard gives me much more responsibility than most, which by default makes me a more important person. Yeah, sure. So who's this guy? Hmm, I haven't seen you students before, are you new? I haven't heard of any newcomers for this week. Hope you know intruders are fed to a giant spider in the basement. Well, luckily for you, we are not intruders. No, no. How could we be intruders if we are wearing your uniform? I mean, riddle me that, Batman. Okay, so where am I going? I'm assuming I can leave. Hold up. What's down here? Ooh, a door. And also, some other stuff. Joining this school pushed the word difficulty to new limits for me. Now, completing its courses pushes the word impossible instead. Hmm. I'm working on a magic spell that makes all exams a breeze. It simply turns your paper into a key. Or into the key. I just hope I don't get an oral exam. <laughs> oh my. Nothing in here then. Basement. Oh, wait a minute. Oh. Oh no. It's like a secret. I'm trying to figure out where we can go. No? I do have the encounters turned off, but. I'm curious. Doesn't seem like it goes anywhere. Unless of course it goes up. It doesn't. Oh, there we go. Oh. Found it. Was this all just for a chest? I have to go down and round. <laughs> there it is. For a mana potion. Of course. Oh god, now I have to find my way out of here. It was left up, up, where the hell? There it is. God, just finding the the opening is a right pain. There we go. I win. I'm back. All that just for a bloody potion. Right, so what's in this room? Seems that we don't actually have any sort of duties to perform, which um, honestly is very nice. A caffeine pill. I can't even read the books. That kind of sucks. <laughs> right, so now I can actually leave this main room. It doesn't seem like there's anything else here. Oh! Ah, okay. Again, I can't read those. I love how the wall is just littered with joy. There's lots of things that say joy. Oh, there's what's his first. Very well, it looks like you found your way into the classroom. It's time to prove yourselves worthy of this school. The exam starts now. Are you ready? Uh, No. <laughs> Not really. No. Come back when you're ready, then.
It doesn't seem like I can go, I can go anywhere else. Unless, of course... No, sorry, I can see into there, but I can't go over there. Unless, of course... Oh, wait, you can. Oh my god, I didn't even go over here. Whoops. Alright, I should probably fully explore. Explore there. I never went down, that's what happened. Okay. Whoo, almost. Oh boy. Are there multiple entrances? No. I wonder if there was multiple ways of getting into the basement. If the students fail, it's more of a failure to me since I haven't been hard on them enough. Or hard enough on them. Which is also a direct insult to my grand teaching skills. I can't do anything but look down on them and on them then. Okay. If I fail the exams, I will be an object of ridicule and scorn, disgrace. Will, my fa will follow my family for centuries, my grades will serve as a reminder of the price of failure. Oh, the horrible pain of studying. Oh boy. So that college in Luden is a spa compared to this torture chamber where we're standing here. Sounds fun. Alright. So where else is there? I can go out here, but I don't know if I'll lead. I might lead to where there's another chest. Oh no, I don't. We got this kid here. It's really much easier to study in the garden. Oh, pardon me. It has life, air, light, pretty much anything you don't find on the school inside. Oh, I can go down. Okay. Oh. Do I really need to use open? Like, opening to get it, get to that chest? Some berries and a mana potion. It's my regular lunch here. Nice. So the berries are like the food. The potion is like his drink. Lithium. I have no idea what that is. Another chest. More berries. Hmm. I mean, it's seeming like I don't have a choice. Thankfully, we have full mana, so it's all good. Hello, Vera. I don't mean to say it. I don't mean to say it the way I do. I wanna go back to that basement, because I can't help but feel that I missed not missed something, but it just seems like a place that's hiding more than just a potion. And also with the fact of how you traverse the place. Uh how do I get to it? Was it from over here? I don't remember. It very well may have. It was. Okay, good. Right, so the entrance was here. And down again. Down again. Left. Down. So I think I can actually go... Is there another... Hold up, what? Have I taken a wrong turn? I can't get down to there anymore. Oh! Oh! Wait, really? Oh, that's where I missed. Oh, okay. I'll go over to the right. I wonder, if they're all in potions, could I not just do potions? If they're all in chests. I wondered if I couldn't just use opening. I suppose they're in chests, but they're like secret chests. Hmm. I didn't realise there was actually just going to be stuff hidden. I think there's... Like, I've gotten everything here? I don't really know. Hmm. So this is what leads into this. Alright. Doesn't lead anywhere else. Huh. Alright, whatever. Can I warp? No. Yeah, I'll just get out of here the normal way. If I can. There we go. Going up. Right, perfect. Shorted. So I came back. <laughs> came here for, you know. Was it more aloe vera? I think it may have been. Right, encounters are back on. But I'm not going back into the... 
Uh, basement. God. <laughs> I don't know what to call it. I nearly just called it Dungeon. But it does have a proper name. Right, save, and now we can take on the test. Alright, head maestro. Let's do it. So... Looks so like you found your way to the classroom. You're ready to start. Yeah! Trial! Wait. I will test your ability of logical thinking. You have to organise these boxes into spots on the ground. Good luck. Okay. I don't want to fuck this up. There we go. Oh. Yeah! I did it! Nice work. I'll teleport you to the next level. Whoa. Get ready. Good luck. Wait, what? What on earth? I could actually move this one. These are one of those where you've got to be careful. Can I go through this? Yeah. Uh. Right, okay. I'm assuming this can go into the middle. Yeah. I'm just thinking. And looking at it. Uh. So that could go there. One thing I want to see is, can I go... I can't go any lower. Oh. Oh, how could I do this then? <laughs> Shit. Uh. Oh, well, hang on. Uh, I don't think there's a way of getting to that, is there? Nope. Shoot. Oh, I'm fucked, I think. Yeah, I can't... I can't do anything else. Can you reset this? I'm stuck. What a shame, do you want to restart? I do. Alright, okay. Could I not do this one first? Oh, no, I couldn't. Actually, maybe I could. Oh, could... Oh, no, I couldn't. What if... I just didn't put that in the middle? So if I just put it there, for example, then I could do this, and then that could go there, and I could do that, right there. Oh! I think I've fucked up again. No! Yeah, I've just realised. Shite. I need all of them in place. I think. So like the first of... Yeah, yeah, yeah. The first one needs to be... There. Oh god. Alright, so I can get this around. And I can push it. To there. And I can do the same with this. Just don't push it into, into its place. There. Ba, ba, da, 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 da. Right, okay. I should be able to just do this. Oh boy. Yeah, I've done it, I think. Just don't cock this up. Da, da. Oh man. I won again. That one took me a lot long. A lot longer. Way to go, Hostin. Impressive. I'll teleport you to the next level. Oh Christ. Huh? Don't disappoint me now. Good luck. How? Ah! <laughs> oh my god. That's why I hate the autopath thing. It's stupid. Don't disappoint me now. So if I just did this. I wonder. If I moved this. 
over to the left. Uh-huh. I can't go any further down. Oh, bugger. So what can I do next? I want... wait a minute. If I can push them all back... No, maybe not. <laughs> uh... Actually, if I could do, I could do that, and then I'd be able to get to either side of it, so I could push it back into place. Uh, and that's the same deal. Oh, now I okay, I could make, I could move this one around. Yeah. Hmm. I'm just looking at it and thinking, like, where I could take this to. Yeah. Actually, if I push... there... But how? I have an idea. Okay, this one was way easier than the second puzzle. What? That's it, I passed. Very good, but this is only the beginning. Follow me. What the shit? Here, you'll be tested for your ability to formulate strategy against your opponent. You're playing against my most valuable students. You'll start with one explosive frog. Once you place it on the ground, it will inflate until it blows up and destroys everything nearby. I've hidden some explosive frogs under some of these blocks. If you find them, you can place more explosive frogs to trigger a chain reaction. But whether if you're hit by any frog... It Explosion, including from your own frog, you'll be knocked unconscious, and we'll lose the match. Good luck. Oh, great. Does this play like Bomberman? <laughs> Round zero, start. Oh my god, it is. It's, it's Bomberman. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> so now I can place two? Okay. Oh god. I'm oh I'm not really the best at this. Yeah, you can set off chain reactions. Oh god. Uh, fuck! Oh that scared me. That exploded way sooner than I thought it would. Oh that's that was so bad. That really fucking spooked me. Oh boy. Alright, so there's another. Right there. Boom. Boom. Fucking excuse you. Prick. Oh, you didn't get caught on my thing. Oh, you douche. Oh, you fucking suck. <laughs> That's happened twice now. It just decides to explode when it wants to. Wait, did I win? Hold up. What? I got to round two. Somehow. I don't know how, but I did. Okay. I'll take it. Man, I don't care. Uh, excuse me, dude. Can you fuck off? Oh, you're a dick. Uh, I'm scared of my own frog. Oh my god, this is so crazy. I'm just waiting. Oh dear. Ah. Oh, I can actually pass through. Oh. I didn't know that. Jesus. I've just been, I want to play really cautiously. And hopefully they can just kill each other. Oh dear. Where the hell is everybody? I don't know. Oh my. What on earth? I'm scared. Can he just blow himself up? Oh my god, he has a huge range. Okay. I don't like this. 
the oh, fuck you. What a prick. Round three. What? I'm assuming I must just have to be like one of the last standing or something. I'm waiting. I don't want to screw myself. Boom. No more frogs. Froggy. Nice. Shit. Ah. Oh god, I didn't want to do that. That was just a bad move. So if I did bar and a bar. Oh, sha! Sure, what did I do? Oh. Round four. I'm so confused. Like, how am I getting to round four? Or does it... I just... I have no idea. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Whew. I was not sure. Shite. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, screw you, bitch. <laughs> ah, he got owned. That actually worked out really well. Yeah. Is there more dudes? More than just the one? I don't know. The thing is, like, with there being a massive black bar, it's just, I hate it. It's just like I can't see. Right, that guy's just laying them everywhere. Matt, you fuck. Oh, there's another. No, mine, mine, mine. There's how. Okay. Oh. Holy crap. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I almost killed myself. See, I need to be at the same point as him. Is he just gonna stand there? What? Okay, he did. Oh my god, I did it. Ah, I won this stage. I don't know why it went to like round four. Was it because I lost? I can feel you're starting to get the hang of it. I have no idea, but whatever. I win. I don't care. <laughs> oh, that was ridiculous. Oi, oi, oi. Right, so what's the third trial? What? The heck is it? oh what? Oh, I have to do this multiple times. <laughs> no. Great. Oh, that took me ages. Oh fuck! I didn't even see that. Wow. Well done. I'm an idiot. Yeah, I didn't even see his frog. Oh, what am I doing? Just waiting. Bomberman was honestly one game that I was never very good at. Good at. I don't know why, it's just one of those games. Just hoping I could trap him. It seems I have trapped him. Never mind. Owned! Oh, he is screwed. Ha ha ha! Sucker! Oh shit. Oh god, that could have screwed me. Entirely. <laughs> I win! That was much easier. <laughs> yeah! Okay, follow me. So is this the third and final stage? Or is that... Is... is... Is the second stage the last of the trial? I really hope so. It would suck otherwise. I don't mind the Bomberman stuff, but I would much prefer to move on to the next minigame. You you progress quite well. You three, go, go back to class. Whoa. It seems like you are ready for the next lesson. Enter the door, your friends await you. Nice. Oh, what? Time to test your dexterity and mind control. I've taken your friends... And they're all surrounded. Uh, oh, no. 
by explosive frogs. Their lives are in your hands, you have 60 seconds to get to them, otherwise I'll blow them up. You have 10 chances to save them. Great. Oh no. Where I had students... I had students washing the path. So some of them are wet and slippery. Ready, go! What? I have nine attempts. Oh god. Oh shit! You have to press it before? Oh Jesus, you have to press it before the, the square you're on. Otherwise you just careen off. This is shit. Some of them are fucking slippery. You mean all of them, asshole? Oh god, this is the worst. I'm not gonna be able to do this. I don't think. Ah, oh, fuck you. What if I just mashed a direction? Would that work? No. <laughs> Wait. Oh, what the heck? This is the fucking worst. <laughs> Actually, if you hold down the direction, it seems to work better. Oh god. Ooh. And you an ass. Hole. Oh, you fucking serious. You have two attempts left. Good luck, you're fucked. Actually, you can just hold down the directional buttons. Seemingly. Yeah. Oh, it's 60 seconds per. Oh no, checkpoint will give you 5 extra seconds. You have 46 remaining. Great. Where's the chest? No, it wasn't in here. Crap. Oh dear. <laughs> this is ridiculous. You are sad a sadistic individual, Professor Sir. Although, this is something you can't influence on how quickly you fucking do it. I have to do it all again. This is shit. Oh no, I was doing so well too. Man. I really don't like this. But no, that's what I was saying. This is something you can't influence. Oh god. In terms of, like, how quickly you do it. 46 again. Yeah, it's the same as before. What if I run out of fucking tries? They just die. Great. Uh. Oh, fuck, I did it. Oh, my God, I did it again. <laughs> Just so poor, you're not ready for this test. Prepare yourself better and come see me again when you think you can take it. I really do not like that one at all. It's so shitty. Yes. Did I just do repeat all of? Oh no, good. Oh boy. Yeah, I don't care. Just fucking get me to do this. No, it's like if you press any directional button. When you're on any of these, it will ju you'll just fly right off, which is why it sucks. See, if you press the directional button a bit too early, you're screwed, and you'll just go straight off. But I'd, I'd have much preferred if just some of these were slick, and not all of them. This first one isn't too bad. Alright, so I'm at 46. Thank you! On the plus side, I'm glad that if you run out of attempts, you don't you don't just like lose all your friends. You just have to retry it, which is fine. Da -da -da, da -da. 
He can't give me like five seconds for this. Because <clears throat> if he does, then what the heck? Also, he calls it a checkpoint, but I'm like, what? How? How is it a checkpoint? Ooh. Five? Okay, I got a rainbow gem. Jeez. Must one of these paths must be a better one than the other. Whoa. Oh, you are such a cock. Yep. It seems that one had you slide right off as soon as you touched it. Ah, such bullshit. Uh, well, I'll be happy when I'm done with this. Jesus. Alright, first one down. Not too bad. Five extra seconds. I've only got 45 this time. How did I lose another second? That makes no sense. Oh god. The thing I hate the most is the fact the checkpoint is not even a checkpoint. A checkpoint would, like, makes it sound like if you fell off it would start you from that point. But it doesn't. It starts you all over again. Which is stupid. On the plus side, I won't have to waste time getting the item. So I already got it. Yeah. Uh, hmm. So how does this one work? Okay, this one isn't slippery, it seems. But the first two were. Oh, it's because you slip onto it. You now have 12 seconds to reach your friends, and I'll disarm the, ex ex disarm the explosive frogs. Go! Okay. I did it. That was easy. Impressive. You finished the test with only 11 seconds left. I finished on time, now release my friends before those bombs blow up. Those bombs? They're not bombs, it's just an illusion spell. Look again. Yeah, I figured as much. What the? You did it, Hostin. We're all fine. I needed to have you on your psychological edge to properly test you. I see. Well, you made it to the top of the class. Please show yourself at the library to receive your prize. Yeah! I wasn't too bad. I did not like that test, but in the end, it wasn't all that terrible. Could have done without every single block being slippery, though. But, whatever. Oh god, my stomach. Oh, that's what he was guarding. Okay. Ah, oh, god, here comes. Who the hell are you? So religious books with violent content don't need an age rating while the fiction books do. That's unfair. Hmm. Yeah, I think. Yeah, there we go. That is what he was guarding. Ah. Whoa. So unfair. Why don't they let us study more instead of cleaning? They'll, they'll just get more dropouts with these stupid rules. And I'm sure they don't want that. Oh, there's a chest here. Don't care if there's a way of getting it legitly. Well, this is still legit. It's just... What the hell was that? What's the point? I don't care if there was a way of getting it without using opening. Opening is just easier. Lithium. Oh, it heals MP. Oh. Well, our never raises magic defense by a bunch really does. Have we got anything else in here? I hate to say it, but I'm glad I wasn't the only one who failed. Imagine cleaning this whole place all by yourself. It would take a while. What? Huh. You know, there are a lot of people at the top of class here. Excuse me. Excuse me. What? Sorry, I was just wondering. How did you do on your exams? Failed them. What's it to you? Oh. Okay. Well, we were told to come here as a reward for passing. Ha! <laughs> New kids. You fell for that? They pull that stunt every year. The kids who failed have to clean up and the kids who passed have to manage the clean up. You're kidding. Nope, but you just made my day. Thanks, buddy. Oh, really? Now, children, we need this place spotless. Our benefactor will be paying us a visit soon. And as it is was as it was his money that paid for this wonderful library, we need to show him we appreciate it. We're trusting you all. Good luck. And, uh, Edisa, is it? Uh, yes, sir. I'm so proud of you and your friends. I hope you re 
you appreciate this reward. And what reward would that be? While the unlimited leadership potential... A task like this will provide you, of course. Oh, it seems like work now. But trust me, you'll be grateful for it in the future. Sir, your benefactor, what is his name? We know him as Cleoneo. Lord knows if that's his real moniker. You know how eccentric these businessmen can get. But he funds this library and a good portion of the school. Cleoneo? Again? I'm getting tired of his name. Excuse me? Oh, well, it sounds like someone we should be looking up, no? Well, take care, children. I'll be back to check up on you soon. Yeah, we'll be long gone, don't you worry. Oh, that guy's going through us. Let's search this place, there may be more information on him. You got it. Before I do that, I want to find the, uh... If there's any other chests. The downright most bookshelf... Oh, downright most bookshelf has a magic book that teaches a very powerful spell that only a true wizard can handle. The downmost... This one? Oh god. It isn't this. Examine every single bookcase. Right, okay. Come on. Jeez. Right. The down right most. Which would be one of the ones that's... Unless it's over there. Like they... Are these bookshelves? I guess they are. Oh, there we go. Yoga Sutra. So who's this for? I've already got that. May the gather be with you. Wait. Who learned that? <laughs> I don't even know. Right mind. It must be that. Oh, fuck. That concentration face. There is no chest around. Did that really waste? No, it didn't. Okay, good. That must be what she learned. Yeah. But I mean, whatever. I'll take it. Clear Neo. Well, what can I say? If someone has a lot of power and is working on something he is very secretive about, my first thought is that he's up to no good. Yeah. Oh, I've met Clear Neo. He is handsome, rich, uh, handsome, intelligent, rich, and strong. A classy type any woman would fall for. And most who met him already have, including me. If only he didn't work so much, but ah, uh, it's for the best for all of us, I hear. And I believe in him. Hmm. Right, okay. There's probably only one bookshelf. I wonder how a poor guy like Clear Neo managed to get himself a castle atop the volcano. There is something questionable about it and the rest of him. But that is something if you talk about. Yes, Cleoneo has a project dedicated to energy. I don't know anything specific. Perhaps he wants to create a perpetual motion machine. Hmm. Right, okay. It's gotta be one of these bookshelves. I mean, it doesn't have to be, it's just what I'm assuming. Cleoneo! Oh, wait, I'm talking to that guy through the bookshelf. Not what I wanted. No? So what does my notebook actually tell me? Must be more information on Cleoneo. I mean, I'm interacting with every bookshelf. I'm assuming it, it might be bookshelves that I don't, like, automatically try and pathfind my way around. But I also have no idea. Keep on looking. Nope. Either that or it's one of the ones that are down here. Fuck. Uh. Where's this? Nothing. I'm not seeing anything. Uh. Hmm. Oh. Is there like a hidden compartment? Oh my god, there is. Hmm. This really needs some renovation. I can't believe it. Yes, it looks like we almost missed a big chunk of history here. Wait, Edison is right. What's that? <laughs> What's that? Say it one more time. No time for ego burst in here. But, well, you are right. We hear that name everywhere. 
Oh, Cleonio, that's true. And confusing. Stories about him are so controversial. He's good, but he's bad. What to think? Well, if all those stories really were about the same man, we have to investigate. Such a powerful man. Do you think Ironheart has something to do with him? They might have some sort of business together. Maybe Ironheart works for him. Isn't Cleonio the one who funds this whole library? Sounds like... Then wouldn't he know about the Emperor's study below? I'm not following you. Okay, let's assume it was Ironheart's footprints down there. He might be here as well, and if that's the case, he'd be looking for this Cleonio guy because he didn't find the book on the secret library. Okay, so how do we find him? It looks like this room keeps student records and other documents as well. I'm assuming they keep records of donations by surely rich businessmen. Maybe we'll find... Oh, maybe we'll be... Maybe we'll be able to find his address. Listen, you guys go on up. Go on ahead. I'll catch up in a bit. Okay. What's she doing? I don't know. Hmm. Okay, let's search for it. Okay, we're searching for suspicious things. It's only going to be in one of these bookshelves. Is this a... Is that a yearbook? Uh-huh. And look who's here. No way, he went to... Went to the school too. Not much info. Graduated top of his class, voted most likely to rescue a baby from a burning building. Stuff like that. Sounds like a kiss ass to me. Wait a sec, who's this guy next to him? I don't know, friend? Roommate? What's his name? An um, Alan Ronixis. That actually sounds familiar. I think I've read some of his articles. He's a professor here. Bonus. We'll just go find this Ronixis guy. He'll know where to find Cleoneo. He might even be able to warn him for us. Is that a good thing? Warning Cleoneo? It sounds like Cleoneo's the um, mastermind of everything. Okay, we need to find and talk to Professor. Renixus. Nobody knew we went into a secret compartment that was hidden in the library. Hmm. Alright. Wait, unlocked... unlocked... Pia Pyromar. What? Okay... We still need to find a professor. What's happening? Who is that? That's Zellini. Doesn't he look like someone from the society? She's up to something. Uh-oh. Oh no. Right. I don't want to follow them, because I don't know what that would lead to. I do want to save them. Right, Professor Ronixus is what we're looking for. Is it one of these guys? Good af- Oh, good afternoon, Professor Renixus. Good afternoon, you're our new students, correct? Indeed we are, sir. Could you spare us a moment? A few, maybe more. How can I help you? Well, you see, sir, we ran across an old yearbook in the library. It had your picture in it. <laughs> really? I'm surprised they still keep them around. Yeah, well, you were standing next to the guy who funds the library. Ah, of course, old Cleo. We were chums back in the day. Always was a bit smarter than me, though. Could you tell us about him? Ah, I suppose. Come. Walk with me a bit. Alright. This used to be our old haunt. We were roommates. Nice guy. A little shy. I don't think he would have left his room if it wasn't for me. Really? So where did he come from? Do you know? I wish. No, I wish curiosity still had hold over me the way it does for you young people. Well, my father was a professor at this school. He was actually part of the board of admissions. That's when he met Cleo Neo and his mother. She told me they didn't have much to offer the school, but that she thought her son showed some potential. My dad was a softie for the beautiful dis uh, distressed, distressed dame type, so he held tryouts for the kid. Was he good? He was remarkable. I think my dad thought he would be as good for the school as the school would be for him. He let him enroll right away, uh, right there, free, f free of tuition. And of course, my dad wanted me to look after him. You did that well, it seems. No, oh, no. His success is his own. I did give him his first beer funnel, though. What does he do, exactly? You know, I'm not sure. He owns his own business, and he's always accompanied by his heavily armed bodyguard. Must be making a fortune seeing how he lives. In a big castle on that volcano top. He's a big source of jobs around here, though. 
None of his employees are allowed to talk about what they do, though. His non-disclosure agreements could probably wrap around this entire school. Wouldn't we be able to meet him? You could try just going to the front door and knocking, but I'm not sure how successful you'll be. We think he may be in danger. That's nothing new. When you're that powerful, attempts on your life are as common as the rain. Worry not, children. His security force is second to none. If you know anything, they know it as well. But anyway, I must be <clears throat> I must be off. I figured my voice was gonna give out at some point. I have classes to teach and you four have classes to attend. Of course right. Hey, wasn't there a fifth member? Well that was a waste of time. Not entirely. At least we know where Cleo Neo is at is at. Uh, if Ironheart is also looking for him, our best chances of finding him or finding my father is to get there before Ironheart does. That makes sense. Then let's get out of here and find Zalini. Her bounty hunter senses might be a good use to us, or for us. Uh, well, but here's the thing. What's the problem? Hoston, Edison, and I think Zalini is up to something. Oh, uh, would you drop it? We saw her talking to a strange man in the school. Really? Who? He looked like he was from the society. Are you serious? Of course we are. Now do you believe me? Someone from the society. Hmm. Okay. We act cool for now. She can't know that we know. Let's find her now. The only way to the volcano area is by boat. So if we can use the same one that brought us here, would be ideal. Alright. Hmm. What is Zelini up to? Not good. Oh, right. We're here now. They lived by the garden. Fair enough. Right. I should probably save. I mean, with this game, I never know what's happening. Or what's gonna happen. So no, my luck, it's like a boss. And I wouldn't save. And then I would die. There we go. I don't even know where they went. Oh, it was down here. Oh. Oh, this is the entrance. Oh my god, that naked guy. He's still running around. Wait a minute, is he running away from us? He is. He was he's actively running away from us. Oh my god. That's great. So where does this go? No idea. I wonder if we can use the elevator to go into the the rightmost thing. Wait, what? Oh god, no. Yeah, the elevator that's like, over this way. Here we go. Oh no, it's taking us all the way down. Crap. Show what I'm looking for. Advantage! Very good. Wait, we all have one gather. What happened? I mean, I ain't gonna complain, but that's a bit weird. <gasps> oh my god! I have that, so I don't need to use gather. Oh yes! Oh, that's incredible! Go for whatever. Holy crap, we do loads of damage now. We do one and a half times. Or 150%. Oh, oh. oh, this is incredible. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is really cool. Oh, my goodness. Hmm. Right. I can't imagine... Unless it's, like, towards the library thing. I don't remember the way to it. <laughs> Dead end! Hey, I don't mind. We do more damage, like, from the get-go, which is great. Advantage! I think I could probably just do this, and probably be fine. 
Bloody hell. Gah! Oh, I love it. Just the amount of damage we do, it's great. Ba 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 ba. Oh god. I really hope Crawler can kill it. Red Ball! I win! Whoa! He did 500 damage. And that was halved. Which means he would have done a lot more. Wait, save point. Don't trust the game. <laughs> Don't trust anything. Oh god, really? <sighs> what? This be a boss. I think. I think it's a boss. I do, yes. Shit. That's fine, actually. Whoa. Yeah, do Blizzard. What's Pure Snow? No idea. He can do Fireball. If I wanted to do anything, I'd do Winter Change. So, gather again. Gather now! Alright. Oh god, it sent out a spider's egg, I think. Yeah, it did. It's behind it. Oh, this is fine. Ba -ba. In actual fact, I may do... Like, gather once more. Blizzard again. Fireball again. And he can do gather again. Don't know what the hell happened there. That was weird. Oh, it keeps sending out more of them. Wait, what the heck? Wait, Edison got put to sleep. By casting fireball. Are you serious? That's so dumb. I mean, whatever. Toxic plan. It requires four. Yeesh. I can do this though. Can I do Blizzard? Alright, he can do Winds of Change. Or Wind of Change. Yeah, it just keeps spitting out spider eggs. Although that was. It's weird that we've only just encountered it. What does Wind of Change do? It recovers health, I think. That's pretty cool. Yeah, just throw everything on it. At it. I don't know if I like Winter Change. Yeah, not really. It's not that bad. It's not terrible, but it could be better. I'd rather just have him attack, I think. Yeah. Ba -ba -ba. That was hard. Was that really a boss? Like, really? Edison slept through most of it. <laughs> I don't even think we got hit once. In fact, I'm pretty damn sure we didn't get hit once. That was really weird though. It just like all of a sudden, boss. Like what? Are you kidding? Oh well. As I say, I don't really mind it. Because it didn't get to attack us. It maybe hit Ali once. Or oh, Alina. Maybe. Not entirely sure though. Just looking at her health, it might have. No, it was probably the um, amoebas actually. Because there were two of those. When the battle began. And I'm pretty sure they lasted at least one turn before they died. Or if they didn't, they at least got to attack once. Before they died. Ah. I still don't remember the way to the... Frickin' library thing. Is it over this way? I don't know. Oh, just doing like 1.5 times damage is ridiculous. It's so good. Like we do 400. Near enough. 400 damage. Whereas before we did, what, 250. It's crazy. A nice change. Was not expecting that. I don't, what the hell caused us to get, like to be able to use one gather? I like to start each battle with a single gather. I don't really know, but it's impressive. Wait a minute. How the hell is Crawler nowhere near level 29? Wait, attacks learned. 100%. All of his spells have been learned. Only six of her spells. All of his spells. He's got two more. Maybe. Wait, he's got two attacks. 60%. Maybe two more attacks? 
Same for her. Wow, alright, cool. I have 50,000 uh, money too. Not too bad. Oh my god, we made it. Wait, it's open. Was it open before? I don't know. I'm just gonna do this. Actually, I'm gonna have her do it. Blizzard! She's probably gonna get... Yeah, whatever. And I win. Oh, I didn't kill them. Fuck. He killed one of them. Oh man. Oh, no! Yeah, it seems if they attack a sleeping person, they do double damage. Which, I mean, makes sense, but... Whatever. It's really not that bad. Edison's got the most health, I think. Okay! Did the, was the door open to begin with? I don't remember. Huh. I mean, I came here because I figured this would be the suspicious place, but maybe not. I mean, I'll fully explore this place. Yeah, not sure. Unless, is this when we actually leave? Via the mine? Because obviously there was a waterfall in the way before, but now there wouldn't be. Oh, well no, there still would be a waterfall, it's whether or not the kids moved or not. The mine. Oh my goodness, this is so new. And totally not expected. <laughs> oh god, where was the exit? I can't remember. How terrible is this place gonna be? Oh boy! Very. Actually, no, it should be fine. Have her attack. And have Edison just use fireballs non stop. Mega Shock! That's new. He can do Wind of Change. No, he can't. He could do Wind of Change if he took um, Gather from other people, but. Yeah, just do Air Blow. And everything died. I love the game kind of like. froze to catch up with what the hell happened. Holy bot! Wait a sec. Airblow was terrible before. What happened? No, Airblow was actually terrible. But now it's doing 400 damage. Okay, I can get behind that. Yeah, there we go. There'll be the exit. These are new. I think. I mean, they, they look new. What are they called? Amoeba. Of course. They're always just called Amoeba. Did they die in two hits? They do! Edison fucking asleep again. They're water amoebas. Ho ho! Ho 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 ho! Ho ho! Oh boy! A thousand damage! My god, Krilla really is a fucking powerhouse now. Jesus! Level 28 and 29. Bloody hell. Only downside is Zelini's missing out on XP. The fuck? There we go. Ah, oh, here comes. I can actually get out of here now. Hey! Wait a minute. Is this a different area? No. Is it? Hold on. Oh, I mean, no, it. It just looked like it was. The mine area. Wait a minute. Tempo. Are <laughs> you crazy? It's too dangerous! Alright. I mean, our only option is to go back to the Noble's Hood. How the hell are we gonna get back to... Like, the dock and everything? Oh wait, the boat! That's right. We need to... We still need to find Zellini. Bum. Bum. I really like the music for this place. I don't know what it is about it. I mean, it might be the nobles, the nobles' hood, but the the music just makes it sound like a super shady place. Yeah. Oh, it's still not even gone to its like proper part. It's when it starts adding in the psh that I really like it. Here it is. Yeah, there we go. That's the best part of the music. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, shoot. 
Where's the save point? Oh, it's around here. It's all good. We got it. Alright, cool. So, there. Uh, oh. mm -hmm. I also want to stop by the inn. There we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So there's that. God, I meant to say yes. Ugh. It happens too much. Yeah, I always just... Oh no, I just mash the X button. And then, you know... I end up skipping past, or, you know, declining certain things, and I'm like, shit! <laughs> Alright, so we need a boat. There is a boat in, um... The Noble's Hood, or the Dock, more so. So, can we use that? Can we use that boat? Boom, boom. So, I guess the first order of business is to track down Cleoneo. If Ironheart is after him, he's going to need more help than his security team can provide. Well, according to Renixus, he lives atop a volcano. Right, because that's a smart idea. If I was rich, I'd live on a floating island held afloat by balloons. I doubt balloons would do the job. I'd buy a lot of balloons. <laughs> so how do we get how do we get across to the volcano? I think it's a bit too far to swim, and if this Cleoneo guy doesn't And this Cleoneo guy doesn't sound like the type to let visitors waltz up uh, waltz on up to his home. Way ahead of you kids. What? Oh. Okay. You're back. I am, with boat in tow as a matter of fact. Got us a good deal and it's small enough that he won't see us coming, if we're careful that is. That's what you've been doing all this time? Hey, I drive a hard bargain. Right. Well, what are you all standing around for? Let's go, we got a rich nerd to save. She's right, let's go. Alright, well we got her back. Thankfully. I wanted to say, finally. But I ended up just saying a mix. Wow, she's only learnt two spells. Huh. Hmm. Alright. The boat. Let's go. It's the same boat as the one before. <laughs> Where's Zelini, though? Is she the pilot? <laughs> is pilot the right term? I don't think it is. But whatever. Is she driving this thing? Alright, very hunch. Yeah. What the fuck? Mini jukebox. Best of. Side B. Where the hell? Oh my god, Vera Hunch is huge! Look at the size of that thing! It takes up half the bloody island. The Trench. Oh god, this sounds fun. Boom, 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 boom. Ooh, this does not seem terrible at all. No, no, it's just, you know, run of the mill. Terrible, terrible idea. Oh boy. Oh great, dead people. Oh. He ain't dead. Oh my god, he sells them for nothing. I like how I'm buying all of them, but it's like... He's got an unlimited supply of ten. There. That's a lot of money I just spent, but I don't care. Save. There's a lot of chests. Oh. Oops. It looked like a dead body. So I'm what the fuck? I'm confused. Bam, bam, bam. Where was? What is the green? Oh, the green's a switch. What the hell is that? What? We're fighting these things? Okay. You know this ain't weird at all. No, no, no. I think I just had held up. No, no, no. I think I just had Hostin. Yeah, I did. I had Hostin attacking something. That he would not be able to hit. Fireball. Oh, uh, wind of chain. Air blow, even. And she can do nothing. Good. Just whip. Whip him real good. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba -da. Oh. Wow. And I win. Right, so, okay. Lots of XP. I'm still concerned, like, what the heck is this? It's a chest that I can't get to. 
I think. So if I did opening, what would happen? There's a chest there, apparently. Oh, I see it. Okay, I couldn't see that before. Oh. Right, I'll go get that first. Yeah. Booyah. Oh no, we're trapped. Technically, we would be trapped if I didn't have access to this spell, I think. This does lead somewhere. Oh dear. Oh god, there's too much. It's overwhelming. Shit. There. That's fine, actually. But I do want to get down to that. There's another chest that's just been, like, abandoned. The poor thing. I think I'm just gonna do the usual. I mean, I don't really mind going through some magic. Only downside is, um, Crawler, because his magic costs a lot. Edisit doesn't. No, not really. Oh shit. Great. Lots of damage. How fun. Uh... Okay. I want Zelini to catch up. Fire gem! Can't go in here. And there is one more. Hold up, there's two more chests. Can I even get to that? I can. I can't get to that though, I don't think. Did you use opening? Screw it. So, what the hell does Bright Mind do? I smell a few chests around. Really? What a pointless goddamn spell. Great. <laughs> hey. That could have been much worse. Oh dear, never mind. This is terrible. Alright, Edison, just do your thing. And he can also do his thing. Shit, I need to heal. Real bad. I really hope that thing doesn't do its rock smash. Oh no, he got put to sleep again. Fuck! Oh no! Ugh! Wow. Oh boy. Oh no. Alright, use Alina to heal. Holy shit, man. Ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Don't move. Yeah, do not move until everybody's back to a better health. Fuck. 456. You're gonna have to heal him again. Perfect. Zelini. She should be at full. Near enough. Where the hell's Crawler? Where the fuck is- There he is! God, so where's Crawler? He's one person that really needs healing. Right there. Three heals is what it took. Ugh. Right there. Fuck me, that's a lot. 681. Alright. Wait. I can't get- I can't get around. Hello, where? Oh, there we go. Much better than the bullshit with that fucking rock spewing prick. All right, fireball, wind of change, air blow. I keep calling it the wrong thing. Whatever. Oh, oh, oh! And there we go. I win. God, so good. Hmm. Wait. It's over to the left. Okay. Oh, great. Actually, I'm mostly curious. Usually just gonna do oh, I'll just do this too. Backtrack. Also Oh yeah, I didn't even think about 
No, never mind. Going down here. No, I can't get over there. I also can't use opening because the chest is not in view. No, what I was thinking of doing was going over to this side and seeing what is in here. But I'll turn I'll turn encounters back on in here. I only turned them off because I didn't want to have like, you know, six battles. Oh. What? Are they teleporters? That's the PSOLA logo, I think. Oh fuck. Oh no. Not too great. Well, there's a chest. Yay, a red chili! <laughs> Lovely! Mm -hmm. Oh, what? I don't... Oh, shit. Wait a minute, is that where I just came from? Go back into it. What? Whoa. Oh god, it leads somewhere else. Oh no! Do do. I did turn the encounters back on, didn't I? Yeah, I did. Okay. Do do. Give me that chest. Oh, napalm! It's about to say there's no enemies. What happened? All right, I'm not wasting mana. Oh! God, when does Alina attack? Fast? Yeah. And then Zelini. Boom. I win. I'm really wondering what the hell caused us to get one gather at the start of every fight. Was it that Yago book? Yogo book? Yoga book? I can't remember what it was called. It must have been, because, like, when I read it, nobody said, like, I've learned a new spell. And then named the spell. So that's the only thing I can think of. Oh, new area. Wait, no, we're not. Actually, we could be. God, what? Hold up. Hold on. What happened? Okay, whatever. Ooh. So, what the shit, dude? This place is kind of confusing. Right, I never went in here. What the heck? Oh, here we go. This is new, at the very least. Question is whether or not I've been... That looks like a doorway. We're back at the beginning. Perfect. <laughs> Alright, I think I went down here. Yeah. That's not a doorway. Yeah, I thought it was. Hmm. Oh my god. This place is ins insane. I've done that one multiple times. Where else can I go? A long ass way. Oh man, really? <laughs> the end of the fucking earth. Boom. Right, okay. Ugh. I don't remember where I'm going now. Do 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 do. Okay. Hmm. So this here. Oh my goodness. So, God, I'm just trying to think where the hell. That takes me somewhere else. I don't know. Crap. 
Ooh. A lot of enemies. This place is ridiculous. Fireball. Uh, air blow. And just attack. Anything. Whatever you so choose. Right, air blow. No. There we go. Perfect. You win. Hmm. He earned a level and he earned green, uh, earned, learnt green ball, which I think would, uh, I assume, would have a chance of, ah oh, fuck, I don't even know where I'm going. Wait, is this a, hold the, oh crap. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm gonna say green ball probably has a chance of poisoning the enemy. So there's that. So, this looks like it took me to a completely different area. It did, I think. And this leads... Okay, this is new, I think. Oh, nice! What'd I do? I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> I hit a switch. Okay, I hit a switch. Now I can leave? Ah, oh, fuck me. Really? What? Oh, not where I wanted to be, but that'll do. What can I buy? Am I actually buying from this person, or are they just a corpse that I'm giving money to? I'm hoping they're alive, but they definitely look like a corpse. I'd probably say they look more like a corpse than they do a person. I forgot to turn off the encounters. It's fine. Alright, so editor, fire stab, something. You can green ball. Ah, oh, shit, you can't. Motherfucker. Right, blue ball them then. Oh, wait, Alina's not gonna be able to take care of that on her own. And I use green ball on a uh, blue ball on something. Oh, dear. What am I doing? Stupid things, of course. Oh, great. Thankfully, one of them's on the ground. There, I think I got it. I win! Okay, that won't too bad. Whew. I don't know why I didn't use Crawler to attack the flying enemy. That's usually my uh, go-to strategy, but... This time I decided to do something a little bit, you know, a little bit out there. A little bit different. Okay, so what the bloody hell have we got in here? Is it another maze? Oh, there's a platform. Wait, is that what that switch was for? Hold a phone. I don't know if it was. No, it can't have been. Oh, maybe it was. Maybe you needed to do that. I really hope not. That's such a pointless movement. Ah, oh, Jesus. Hold up. Aha! Oh my god, this actually does lead to a chest. Oh! Oh no. Oh no. I don't know, I think we'll be alright now, but these guys hurt. I'm just gonna attack all of them. Actually, wait, use, use air blow. Yeah. But I don't have confidence. They die in two hits. Okay. They still do a lot of da damage. <clears throat> oh, you fucking suck. Nice. Okay, that one too bad. The fact they did, like, 400 damage to Crawler kind of sucks, but it is what it is. We didn't get much XP from them either. What the hell's that all about? Okay, heal yourself and then heal Crawler. Potion! Heal Crawler. Is he at full health? Uh, yeah. Pretty much. Um, crit. Where am I going? Can I go over this way? Nope. You can't. Can't go over this way, though. There's another chest. No, no. That's a lot of dudes. Right, I don't even give a shit. Kill them now. 
I, ju I just want the dead. I just want them to die. ASAP. There's a fireball. Oh, yeah, yeah. One ran away. What a bitch. Perfect. I just did not want to give them a chance to even attack. Ooh. Level 20. Hold the... No. No. You did. She sniped it. What a bitch. She's now a higher level than Hostin. Man. Oh, there's a switch. Oh, my. Give me that. Oh. I don't know what it did, but I heard the sound of a platform. Yeah, they make such a nice little whoom noise. Ooh. Fuck. Advantage. Perfect. We don't even need to worry. We don't need to use magic or anything. Woohoo! Kick their ass. And that is all that matters. Why do they why do they run away? Why are they such bitches? Whoop. Right, we win. Hoston gets the first attack, so I know we win. Easy. Shit, I didn't even see what that did said. I think Hoston leveled up. Actually, I know he did. He only needed 5 XP. What the? <sighs> okay, that doesn't lead anywhere. Are there more switches? Like, what is with this place and its obsession with switches? Great, more platforms I can ride. Love it. This is probably, like, necessary for something. Right, okay. I'm trying to think how I could do this. They die in two hits, usually. Could I just... Do this and hope for the best. One down. You suck. Although they did hit people that have a lot of health, so it's not that big a deal. Oh! Wow. The fact we're doing 150% damage is great. They really don't give you anything, do they? Man. Considering the soldiers absolutely schooled us earlier in the game, like what the heck? I thought they would be more rewarding than well, what they are. At the moment, they're mo mostly just, um, underwhelming. To say the very least. Right, there's another switch over this way, and there's a platform. Ah, fuck. This is gonna be bad. Mm-hmm. Okay, it could have been worse. It seemed like it was gonna be real bad. Firestone. Blue ball. Whip. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Oh my god, they ran away scared. I mean, understandably. We just, just one-shot them. Also, Edison fell asleep. I just realised. His weapon put him to sleep. Right, so here's the other weapon. Uh, weapon. Switch. There's nothing here. I can hear my, um... thing going crazy, though. Right, so there's another platform. It is literally just... Go here, activate a switch, to use a platform, to go here, to activate a switch, to use a platform. That is basically what I'm doing. I think. Platform? No. I do see a chest though. Oh no. Oh, we didn't get ambushed. All's good. Does Toxic Plant hit everybody? Oh, it does. Hmm. Hmm. I'll do. Wait. I thought you need. Oh, I need four. Fuck. Zelini. There we go. Air blow. Oh yeah. Brilliant. I really just want to see what this does. Oh, it, it really does just create one of those. Now that is awesome. Oh my god. Hmm. Austin just regained the lead. <laughs> he now has more XP than Alina. Only just. Wow. I can't believe the power of that thing. Especially considering his magic attack power is 7. Whereas everybody else's is in the double digits. Oh, Edison is only 4. Oh, never mind. Okay, I thought magic attack power was much higher for everybody. Oh. <gasps> How do I get to that? I want it. I want it so bad. Oh. Great. I missed a chest. It's an orange one, though. 
So I need a, uh, thing for it. I'm doing the same. I don't care. Alina, Edison, Zelini, and then Crawler, Airblow. This works out so well. It's ridiculous. Woo! Love it! Uh oh. Oh. Little my. Uh oh. That was my attack. The only downside is it requires a lot of magic. Hmm, kind of. But, I don't really mind. It's a, it's a pretty good attack. There we go. Hello, Weira. I really just want that orange chest. Can I get... No. Thought maybe I could get around it. Wishful thinking, I believe. There's another there either. There's another chest. How do I get... Hold the... Hmm. How do I get to the orange? Wait, how do I get to this? I can't. Oh, screw you. Frick. No! Electrode! Actually, what I'm going to do is use up some of these. That's 120. Okay, these are really, really good. They give more than I thought they would. Hell yeah. Bloody hell. Fuck. <laughs> no! Fuck. Uh, I might actually just use up some uh, health potions. Yeah, you can all screw yourself and die. I could just attack, I know it kills him in one shot. I'm not actually doing this to get like lots of XP for Hostin. I'm mostly doing it because it, it's the quickest way of killing them. Because it's a one one hit kill. So why would I not? Can I open up orange chests even if I don't have a key? I wonder. I never actually thought about using opening on them. I can. Does it work though? Yes. That's bizarre, but alright. The orange chests are usually locked. Right. Oh. This place looks fancy. Cleonio Fort. Oh. Is there a save point in here or am I... Is that wishful thinking? Well... Yeah, it seems it would be. Well, I don't care. I can kill these guys in one shot. Oh! Bum 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 bum. Dum dum dum. I'm just trying to figure out how I'm really far away from the end. I thought it was near the end of the game. Yeah, but thankfully not. Whew. The fuck? What is this? What? Okay. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to see if it saved me. Save me. If I could save my game. What is beeping? Hmm. So that's like even better than a Well, it's it's basically an in. A much quicker one. Right, these ones I'll just do, usually. Yeah, just no 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 no. Blue ball. Hit them with your blue balls. Wow, insta kill. Insta kill. Insta kill. Oh, these guys should really just run. Oh yeah, yeah. Potion plus. Oh shit, where am I going? There's another. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just do my usual. Although I do keep forgetting to use blue ball. Ah, oh, that sucked. I didn't manage to one-shot them. Oh well. There we go. Oh yeah. Got real lucky. Oh 
Level 8, at uh, 28. Oh, there we go. Aha! There's that. No! You suck! Ugh. I'm totally going back to the Pearsola logo. I don't care. Actually, no, I'm not. I thought more of them were going to attack, but they didn't, so all's good. What the hell? There we go. Oh, 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 oh! Yeah! It's ridiculous how well that works. Oh boy! Level 30! Holy crap, he has blasted past! I didn't want to do that. <laughs> Level 30. I mean, he's not that... Oh, yes, he is. He's like 900 ahead of her now. Has he caught up to Edison yet? He ain't far about. He ain't far behind. Not bad. Might save. Have I missed anything? Uh, only a little. Okay. I mean, there might be six of them, but still. Did not insta kill. What the fuck? Oh no! Oh yeah, I didn't heal. Whoops. I didn't think it to do that. I'll just use up some herbs, probably. I have a lot of those. Never really thought about using them, to be honest. I'm mostly just like, eh, I'll just use potions. But why not use the herbs? They heal less than a potion, but I have like 60 of them. So I may as well use them while I can. Or while I have them, also. Right. I also have two of these. No, no, no. May as well use it on her. And her. Yeah. Oh god, does it really heal that little? Oh no, 216. That's loads. There we go. I didn't even use up that many. Right, save again. And then equip. Peeps for the upcoming battles. What do we have? So she's got an antidote. What else do we have? He's got frying pan. He's got the power glove. I kind of like them. To have what they have, honestly. That's just healing items are more effective. What else do I have? Increases agility by a bunch. Mm -hmm. Nah. Nah, I'm good. Honestly. Bum 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 bum. Oh god, what is that? Oh, it's Rudy, I think. Is that Cleoneo? It's unfortunate we had to meet like this. I've been waiting for some time. I will have nothing to do with you, Cleoneo. You destroyed the book, correct? It wasn't there. We looked everywhere for it. You mean you could oh, you mean you couldn't find it? No matter, there's nothing in that book that could lead us to it. Or that could lead to us. But shouldn't we plug any possible leaks? We can't take any chances. Irrelevant. We need only one thing to complete PSOLA. Three things, actually, and I believe you can help with that. You're de deluded if you think I'm going to help you. How dare you talk to her like that? You are insane. Don't you understand what sh what this is? What she is? You can't even bring yourself to say her name, can you, father? Hold up, what? Cleo News. Rudy's son? Hostin's brother? No. <gasps> What's happened? Oh, there we go. We see them. Well, I thought we'd at least give him a chance. Reconstructing it would certainly have been easier, but I guess he's made up his mind. You're damn right I have. In that case, Ironheart? Yes, sir. You may end it. The quicker the better. There's no need to make him suffer. A quick death, Rudy. My gift to you. And let's be honest, that's more than you ever did for me. Oh, boy. Oh! Who the hell are... Dad, are you okay? Oh, no. Oh, uh, now I see. Ironheart, I've changed my mind. When you finish with these brats, make sure to kill him slowly. I want him to feel every last second. Yes, sir. Surprised we made it this far, Ironheart. I'm surprised you haven't stopped following me around like a lost puppy, convincing yourself that I was brainwashed, mind-controlled. Anything to deny the possibility that I made a choice, that I made the right choice. The Ironheart I knew would never do this. The Ironheart you knew is standing before you. 
Whoa. Why isn't it working? I've been carried up until this point, but you don't know when to end, end a journey, do you? It's not working. You foolish children. I want to give this world life again and you dare, to tr dare try to stop me. Don't listen to him. He's mad. Ah, oh, fuck me. Well, Zellini. Looks like we're right on time. Rudy, you've looked better. What are you doing here? Well, it looks as if we're going to be saving your ass. A confederacy of dunces. How amusing. What's going on? You're lucky we've come all this way for you, Rudy. But after the goer men, I suppose we owe you something. The goer men? You tricked me. You were the ones that wanted them wiped out. You said you wanted to make peace with them and you sent me in to... to... Deliver an offering, yes. Sorry about that whole thing. We really... Thought your immune system would be able to handle it. Hell, it took so long for you to show symptoms, we thought you were safe. You're the ones who destroyed our, our goer men? You bastards. Uh, who are the bad guys now? Haven't the vloggiest. I just really want to know who we're supposed to hit. You'll pay the price for crossing us. Hostile in the machine. Destroy it now. Oh boy. Father, what is this? No time. Why did he call you? This is our top priority. Help me, do help me destroy this. I think we've... I think you've done enough damage to us, Rudy. I've made mistakes, Cleo Neo. Yes, too many to count. But if there's anything I can do for you, it's to prevent you from making the same ones. <laughs> no! Oh dear. Dad! You son of a... Bitch! Oh god, he's bleeding. Oh no. Edison, we have to help Hostin. Let's go. Not so fast, kids. That machine is ours. Shut up. What? You... You've tricked me. You're a bounty hunter. It's not your job to ask questions as long as we're paying you. I won't cope with these twisted ideas of yours. You've just picked a fight with me. Let's go, Alina. Oh, bloody hell, what's happening? What the hell are those? Wait, who is this? Do I dare do gather? No, not really. Blizzard! I'll need her to gather. Oh dear, he just pimp slept her. Damn, backhand. Mofos! Right, I'm just gonna have to do Blizzard again. She's gonna gather again. Oh, he keeps bitch slapping her. Alright, heal herself. And then she can actually do a lava fall now. Oh, she only needed to. Oh, well, whatever. How much does that do? 515. Oh, he keeps calling upon ape disciples. So if she actually did, like, Aqua Arrow, I'm wondering how much she does, damage-wise. 348, about the same as her spell. Oh god, he's gone insane. What the f- <laughs> What is with the animation? What the heck? I really want to do that. Gather now. Lava fall. I don't know what's with his animations, but I like them, they're funny. Uh, gather, and gather now. Lava fall. Oh no! Oh shit, they can poison, that's right. I like all he does is just clap, and then like, screams. It's like, ah! <laughs> it burns! Oh god. Oh my god, we won! <laughs> That was easy. <laughs> I win. Not too shabby. So, there's that. Whoa, okay. Level 30. Hostin's gonna be the furthest behind again. Oh my god. You made the choice to stay with the society even after what they did to me. You, you had already betrayed them. And for good reason. Look at what your friend has brought upon us. You think they're going to help you? Shut up. Well, I mean, they're dead, so. Yeah, shut up. You're a fool, crawler, and my mercy has its limits. Ooh. Oh my god, this is cool. Just the music. Blue ball. Yeah, blue ball him. Super no. God, that's too much gather. Shit. Oh, I'm worried about this. Oh shit, Edison. Fuck. He puts himself to sleep. Oh no. Oh, shit. 
I really need to use Wind of Change. No, God, what am I doing? Air blow. I guess. I can't really do fucking anything while Edison's asleep. This would work out better if Edison wasn't asleep. I'm just gonna gather. Keep on gathering. There we go. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Not good, not good, not good. <laughs> Real bad. Right, Heaven Blow. Yes. He can do Fireball. Man, that kills him. Full health. Perfect. Yeah, Edisit's fine if he gets attacked, because he has a fucking ton of health. A metric shit ton. I actually could attack him with, like, Napalm. How much would that do? 520. It's not really that good. Downside to this is Crawler does not have... Actually, wait. Wind of Change. That heals him, I think. I'm pretty sure. So if he actually called upon multiple dudes... Oh my god, are you shitting me? He couldn't do it because he stole Gather. That's stupid. That's really dumb. Whatever. Oh god. Right, now I need to do Heaven Blow on Editor. I could try and save up for Supernova, but... Fuck's sake! His shit keeps putting him to sleep, which is really annoying. Really fucking annoying. Right, gather again. Right, I want to try Wind of Change. Wind of Change. No. Oh god, he's gone like crazy as well. What the fuck? Uh-oh. Is that Supernova? The fact that keeps happening is fucking stupid. I don't even know what it is, but it sucks. Could I just use a chili? Yes. I don't know how much it gives. Five. Perfect. Oh god, he can cast a bunch of stuff. How oh, fun. He's down to four gather now. Fuck me. It's not worth it. Yeah, I'm just gonna have him on heal. <laughs> Healing duty! Supernova? He actually could do that. Would it be worth it? Wow, three times damage. Yeah, he's gonna constantly be doing this. Great. No, right, Edison's back to full. Now he just needs to do that himself. He can attack. He does a lot, to be honest. Uh-oh. Whoo, that was close. Right, I think we're actually okay to attack. Blue ball, and just attack. Just regular, I don't care. I don't know why this happens, though. Great, so he's doing that again. Do I chance it? I do. Do I regret this? Probably. Oh, we won! Okay, that one too bad. That one was harder than Sashia, that's for sure, but that honestly wasn't too bad. But the fact he, like, when he attacks, that's bad enough, but then he starts using spells that hit everybody. Jesus. Right, well Ironheart's dead too. Huh, you don't have a chance. I'll kill you. Enough. Uh oh. Oh god. Uh, what? Cleoneo, come. There's little hope left here. We'll have to start again elsewhere. Ladies and gentlemen, you have indeed caused us much trouble, but fear not, my mercy is infinite. And while you do not yet know the power of Piazzola, its light will shine on you all, and you'll repent for the mistakes you've made today. Oh boy. And Rudy's dying. Or dead. Whose side are you on? I'm fighting for you, aren't I? You brought this on us. They told me about them... That they were going to stop them. I didn't know they were after its power. I didn't even... I don't even know what that is. Shut up, you two. He needs our help. Yeah, I think Rudy's dead. Oh, no. Hold on. Oh, fucking Jesus. What happened to him? Yeah, he definitely ain't... <laughs> isn't rejoining. Oh, no. Austin, I'm so proud of you. I can't believe you made it this far. What did he mean? He was telling the truth. His real mother... 
and I, before your mother, of course, we... Is that true, Dad? Cleone is a liar. Austin, look at me, it's true. This man, he's your brother. Dad, hold on, you'll be fine. Austin, listen. When I was a member of the society, they had me... They had me journey to the Goa Man. They told me I was to make an offering of peace. It was plague. I didn't know. I believe you, Dad. It's okay. Now listen, the compass. I think that's what they wanted. They wanted to go to... Adakol. How do you know? Wow. That's brutal. Oh my god. Poor Hostin. Dad? Dad! Wake up! Wake up! Ah! Uh, wow! <laughs> Can't you do something? Whew. What was it? She called it Pia Sola. The same on the sketch at the secret library. It looks like. Is it operational? No, it's incomplete. She also mentioned something about needing three things to complete it. Uh-oh. Oh, you've got to be kidding. They're trying to bury us alive. Run! Oh god. Great. I don't even know how far I have to go. Oh, this is new. Actually, no, it isn't. Oh, what am I doing? Really? Oh my god. Um, yeah, do the usual. Hossa needs to catch up on XP anyway. <sighs> nice. There we go. Hoston will catch up eventually. I wonder if it's actually burying us. I mean, we haven't seen a timer, so I'm concerned. And we're safe. If only. If only it were that simple. Right, and we're out. Oh, there we go. We're fine. I'm turning off encounters. I don't need to fight Moshe. Actually, wait, no. I'm really indecipher when it comes to... When it comes to that. I'm like, I'll turn it off. No, I'll turn it on. No, I'll turn it off. But I might as well, I can just use Toxic Plant to take care of anything. I wish to. Crap, where the... Oh, it was here. Whoop. I think. Yeah, there we go. Now I'm just going to use the same thing for every fight. Yeah, just so then Hoston gets up to speed with everybody. I'm not saying he's been like, abandoned, but he'll definitely be further behind. XP wise. At least I think so. But to be fair, it's against soldiers. They give barely anything. But it is what it is, I suppose. Yeah, you got like 500 that time. If I actually check. Oh no, there we go. He's practically caught up. And Zellini hasn't exactly. <laughs> Zellini is the one that's been left behind, if anything. <laughs> Right, so... Yeah, there's a chest over to the... To the left. But I still don't know how I get to it. Even with these, I'm gonna do the same. But for now, it's mostly just because it's quicker. To deal with them all. Who needs a fair fight when you can just instantly kill everything? Man. Oh, that thing, like, exploded. You know, that, like, crystal beast. I don't know what the hell it is. Nice! If I could have Hostin be the highest leveled person, that'd be awesome. I mean, like, not higher level than Kruller, because Kruller's quite far ahead of everybody. 
but higher than editor at least. Uh, this one's fine to do without magic. It's literally if we go against the the douchebag. Yeah, the the crystal thing that likes to you know cause the ceiling to crash down on you. All right. No. No. There we go. Very cool. I win. Oh no, he missed. How could he? Well, we've nearly made it out of this place. Whew. Right there. Do I really want to save? But of course. Wait a minute. That wasn't there before. Or maybe it was. Well, what do you know? Our boat, it's gone. Let's go back. There must be another way out of here. Austin? Austin, we need to focus. I know a lot's happened. It's overwhelming. But we need to get out of here. You need to go. What? Give us a minute. Alina, listen, we... Krilla, come. She, know what she, she knows what she's doing. Not you, Edisa. Oh, okay. Huston? Krilla's right, we need to keep moving. No, we don't, Huston. We, you can... Oh, we can stop. You can rest. You're allowed to be tired. You're allowed to be weak. You just lost Rudy. I'm not stupid, I know that. We... We just lost Rudy. Huston, come here. Aww. Couldn't save him. Dad was counting on me. He needed me. He wouldn't have fared like this if it was us. He would have found a way. And now he's... It's not your fault. It is. I... It's not your fault, Hostin. If I was stronger, if we acted more quickly. It's not your fault. Stop saying that. It's not your fault. Ali, I want my dad back. I can hell. Ali... I'm going to see what we can do to get out of here. You guys can stay for a moment. And Hostin? Yeah? If you were anything less than who you are, we wouldn't be here. And I'm grateful for for you. You've protected us this entire time. Every moment that we've needed you, you've been there. But Hostin? It's okay to need us too. Thanks, Edison. I'll be back in a bit. Just hang tight. Thanks for your kindness, Ali. I mention it. That's what your big sister is for. Let's find out just before he gets into trouble. And Ali, one more thing. Yes, Huston? You're not my sister. <laughs> there we go. You alright, buddy? Yeah, I am now. Sorry I stalled you guys. It's okay, Huston. Even the toughest persons have their weak mom moments. Have you guys seen Edison? Yeah, uh, yeah, he went past us looking all around with that curious look of him. Oh my, I hope he doesn't get lost or hurt or... I'm fine, I'm right here. What? Oh. I found a switch. It was hidden. Oh gosh, you didn't push it, did you? Of course I did. How can you see a switch and not push it? Well, if nothing bad happened, yeah, it... it <laughs> I'm safe to assume. It's safe to assume it must have affected something somewhere else around here. And let's go find it. Hopefully it will help us find a way out of here. Wow. This has been super eventful. Where the fuck... Oh my god, that's how you get that chest. Oh, that makes sense. Wheel. Actually, I'm gonna buy some more potions. You don't mind, anybody? I mean, you're near enough dead. I've got 90 potions. Fucking me. Can I buy 100? Oh my god, I can. Nice. Yeah, well, I won't need healing po uh, healing items for a while, I don't think. They may only be potions, but they're still pretty useful. Ah, fuck. Fuck. You're a cock. What an absolute prick. Every single time we get ambushed, that douchebag does that. It's the fucking worst. <sighs> well, whatever. Oh 
Damn. Hassan got 600 XP. Yeah, this is where Hassan's probably gonna just pull ahead. I don't mean to, for it to happen. Oh, it's here. That's how we get over to the other side. Oh. Yeah, it is. Yeah, he's gonna pull ahead, because I'm using this just to take care of the enemies straight away. So otherwise it takes too long. I don't really mind having battles that last a while, but you know. There we go. I'm definitely going to be needing to use a potion. At some point soon, probably. He's level 31. Wow, he's only just got there. Jeez. Right. Fire gem. Great. Just whatever I wish. Wanted. Ah. Uh, why do they do no damage? What? Oh, great. Ba 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 ba. Hey, come on. I was about to say what's happening. Wait, does Toxic Plant require 80? I thought it only required 40. Oh, Toxic Plant requires a lot more than I assumed. Well, Oh, I do need to go through here. Oh, okay. I'm assuming that's where I need to go. Shit. A huge amount. It barely even got me up to max. Wait a minute. Oh, so you can actually have a hundred. It's just the stack is only ninety-nine. Okay. Nice. I used up a cola. Probably a waste. Thank you. So how much does it oh it is eighty. Oh shit. I thought it was only forty. Oh dear. Uh, blue ball and whip. This should still work. No, I didn't die. I thought it would die in two hits. That's the worst. The fact that it didn't. It should have. Ah, well, whatever. Nice. Alright. There we go. Alrighty. Hello, we're, uh... I'm turning encounters off. Or just down. I'll turn them back up. I just don't want to con constantly fight shit. What? Maybe this is... This is a site of worship. A religious shrine? Right, and that one was Frankenmonk. Well, the architecture is familiar. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. Wait, Cleoneo. Where? No. That's where we've seen this before. Cleoneo's base looks similar to this. Yeah, I guess, but why hide a section of his base out here? Maybe it's a safety measure, just in case all hit the fan. Wait a second. Assume for a minute the base was occupied or for whatever reason, Cleoneo had to flee. Where would he run to? He'd be just as trapped as we are. Unless he had another method of transporting himself back to point zero. Ladies and gentlemen, we found our way home. Not quite, we still don't know how to use it. Remember the dust Aracol gave us? He told us to use it if we wanted to see him. It's worth a shot. Ah. I can't, I can't leave. Oh man. Okay. Use this ancient dust. Interesting. Where is that? Poof. Not sure. Only one way to find out. Wait, look at the bag. Hmm? There, on the bag. No, not, just give it to me. Hey, what are you so excited about? This looks familiar. Edison holds the bag for the group to see. There are symbols on the bag matching the symbols on the transporter. How? I don't understand. Why would they match? No, he's not. He can't be involved in all this. That son of a... Hostin child, don't jump to conclusions. Oh, so this is a coincidence? We're not saying that, but there might be more to the story than... I'll kill him, I swear it. I'll slit his throat the moment I see him. Jesus. Listen, honey, just hold on. 
Look, regardless of our recall's involvement here, we do not or we do need to get home, and he doesn't know what we know. If we decide to confront him, we'll have the advantage. Right, let's handle one thing at a time. Spread the dust into the air. What the fuck? I created like an orb of dust. Whoa, where are we? Ew. That looks so gross. Oh, it worked. Hot <laughs> damn. Are we down below in the basement? Oh. <gasps> We're here. Oh. Who dares? We dare. Holy shit. <laughs> ah, children. Forgive my rudeness. Uh, you know a dragon? Aren't we full of surprises? Mossa, this is Krulla and Zalini. I take it these ill mannered apes are friends of yours. <laughs> Sadly, yes. Hey. Uh, this might be a stupid question, but how exactly is this thing going to help us get home? Thing? <laughs> She's going to give us a ride, assuming you're stopping insulting her. So sorry, sorry. My apologies, uh, ma'am. Hmm. <laughs> well, children, you know I would never leave you stranded. You may climb aboard. Thank you. Do we have to watch this cutscene again? Oh, we don't. Whew. Oh, no, we do. I think, yeah, we do. God damn it. The Sea of Tears. This is so cool. Please, don't put your <laughs> your hands there. The ice castle. And here we are. Oh fucking hell. Off he goes. Halt. Has Huston just completely like flipped the lid or something? Well, it seems we have misplaced our manners. We need to see Arakol. If you wish to see Master Arakol, then I suggest you wait until... Mossa, please. Not now. We need to see Arakol immediately. <laughs> ah, sweet age. Alina, child, you look troubled. What's the matter? Hoston? Hoston, what's wrong? Can it wait? It's been a long day and what we really need is a moment's rest. I... please. Of course, I'll show you to your quarters. Children, Arakol is in his study. The door's usually unlocked. So you can let yourselves in. Okay. Jump to cutscene? Oh god. I was wondering how long it would take before you drop by. Does society test you to follow us? Yes, under false pretenses, if that's a, if that's a consolation. It helps. Alina, had I known, I would not have done anything to harm you or your friends. I'm starting to believe that's true. Really? You helped us back there. You put your own life at risk. Plus, I'm just tired. I don't have the strength to argue with you anymore. You know, I often forget how young you are. Your wisdom exceeds your age. I don't know about that. Lately, I feel like a little girl. I just want to go home, wake up in my bed, spend the day with Huston and Edisa. I miss my mom. Hell, I even miss my dad. That's understandable. So, what about Krulla? What about him? You know, you and Krulla? Huh. <laughs> Krulla and I? Are you kidding me? I thought, I mean, well, I guess I owe you an apology for being so mean towards you. There's nothing out of jealousy to see you and Krulla so close, but if you say there was nothing between you... No, you're much more of my type than him. Wait. You're much more of my type? Oh! I, I don't know why it took me so long to catch that, but... Oh dear. Come here, girl. Wait, I... Everyone needs a hug once in a while. Just a hug. Hmm, you smell really bad. We've been out we've been on the road for weeks. I know, but seriously, I don't think a healthy woman can make that kind of smell. <laughs> Look, go find Hostin, see how he's holding up. And if you promise to bathe. Out Huh. That was unexpected. <laughs> yeah, kinda. Do you wanna save? I fucking do. Wait, what are we doing? Look at that, a penguin! <laughs> He's all happy again. <laughs> oh my goodness. Where is everybody? Like, am I meant to find Arakol or am I meant to find my team members? I do not know. Excuse me. You don't go into a woman's room without knocking. Get out. I'll go, go out. 
Alina is looking for you. Oh, whoops. Sorry. I'm assuming I must just go to the study. Guess so. Nope. I don't remember where the study is. I haven't been here in forever. Dun dun. Hmm. Shit. Oh, God. Is this the study? Nope. I think this does lead to it, though. Doesn't it? There he is. Come in, children. Houston. It's been far too long. It's Houston. Yes, yes, of course. What can I do for you all? That's what I'm saying, I'm not with anybody else. Oh dear. Listen to me, you intellectually atrophied quack. I've got questions for you. Questions that, if not answered to my satisfaction, will end in you losing more than... Helena and Edison enter the room. Hostin! Wait, Hostin, calm down. Quiet, both of you. Do you understand me? I'm not in the mood to play games, and if you don't answer me, I'm going to split you open. My god, Hostin, listen to yourself. Child aim an open book. If you do not release me, I will demonstrate the extent of my power, and I assure you, your friends will be es escorting you out of my home in shifts. No. Jesus. What What have you got to do with Piazzola? Everything. Well, that was easy. Shh, Edison, get ready. Edison, Alina. It is in your best interest to calm down. Uh, well now, it's clear we both have stories to tell. I suggest you return to my dining room. I'll have Mosa fix us something, and we put this unpleasant, or can put this unpleasant affair behind us. I'm afraid that wasn't a request. Oh. <laughs> Wait, so what? Okay, yeah, yeah. Wait for me at the dining room. That's what I'm saying, where the hell am I? So we did get lost in this place. Wait, is the dining room down below? I can't remember. As I've said, this place is a goddamn maze. Actually, I don't think I've explored up here before. Hmm. How lovely. I got green chili. Okay. I mean, there's nothing that great here, but still... It's stuff I can search. Okay, this also isn't... The dining hall is down below. Okay, good to know. Wait, I can go up here. Wait, where did it... No, not it, is it? He disappeared. Well... That wasn't... I was not expecting that. We actually have to go over to the dining room. Oh, here we go. Austin, there you are. Everything okay? Forget it, Crawler. Let's go to the dining room. I think it will all be clearer after that. Sure thing, I'm starving. Me too. Why am I not surprised? Edda sits always hungry. Kind of like me, really. Right, we're here. Sheesh. Now, children, enlighten me. What has happened? The team tells the whole story. I'm afraid I wasn't as honest with you as I should have been. Truth be told, I haven't been as honest... I haven't been as honest as I should have been my whole life. I can only imagine you believe me to be a part of the machine you found. This is as it should be. My sins are something that I cannot outrun. I recall. Crawler, grant me that which I do not deserve. Allow me to speak. I don't under... Okay. Hostin's observation was an accurate one. He accused me of participating in the development of Pier Solar. It is an accusation that I have denied for the last time. What? Please, first of all, yes, I am one of those responsible for the Pier Solar project. But believe me when I say, tyranny was not part of my design. My ambitions for the project were born of benevolence. Though I concur, it was more of a benevolent autocracy. And now I see the error of in that design. For in the presence of absolute power, all benevolence crumbles. 
and so it was for and so it was for our project. Stop, get to the point. Hostin. I mean he wants answers as to why his father died. A machine. Piazzolla is a machine, with power only the most brilliant of minds can grasp. Since we haven't much time, consider this. The universe is a collect a collection of millions of random events, all occurring simultaneously, all in tandem with one another. At the best of times, it produces the most incredible phenomena, oxygen, carbon, life, at the worst of times, disease, death, ourselves. How delightfully optimistic. But what if you could reach inside the universe? That's what Pierre Solar did. It allowed us to see inside this grand machine, and, like a surgeon, remove that which was making it sick. We tried it on, a sm on smaller u universes, creating, shaping, and collect collapsing them over and over again. Wow. The results were remarkable. We created organisms, life, but it was life perfected. No aging, no death. But even in its most minute form, Pia Solar could harness unimaginable energy. We could make the most complex machinery run on, on nothing itself. The need for any consumable resource for, well, for anything was gone, vanished in the puff of a single idea. This was going to be our parting gift to humanity, and Eden, paradise regained. That's impossible. You're right, it was. We are products of, the univer of this universe, after all, not the one we were building. And so our opinions differed. The legend the Goa men told us about the War of the Architects. Impossible. It's just a legend. Three architects discover the door to paradise. They begin fighting over who gets to be the first to step inside. They spend so much time battling that the door closes and locks forever. It's an amusing take on real history to be sure, and not particularly unfaithful to what really happened. In the process of developing Pier Solo, we of course took advantage of the power it gave us. We became stronger, lived longer. We were able to do things, well, things that we shouldn't have done. My colleagues. So Clibo and Bethina, back in Rhea, the writing on the wall. Impressive deduction. Deduction. Yes. Clibo and Bethina were their names. Fortunately, Clibo... Is that Clibo? Cliboa? I don't know. Clibo was on my side. We wished to use the power of Pierce Olaf to fix the problems in our universe. Cure disease. Create renewable energy. And Bethina? She thought that our plans were merely patchwork, and that any true Eden would require a god. Someone to watch and plan, and ensure that human beings, well, stop being human. They imagined the god was to be a goddess. Correct. We fought away... We fought away from here, with the powers that Pierce Solar gave us. Our own war, more horrific than anything seen in this world. Raged behind the curtain. The result was devastating. Not only was Pierce Solar destroyed, but Bethina was killed. Or at least, that was our assumption. Clibo and I just agreed to destroy the plans, and to abandon the project. Though Clibo created one last universe, one for himself. I, however, well... I was going to have to be human, after all. Hold on, that legend is centuries old. That would make you... Well into retirement, we found the Fountain of Youth. Not a mortal per se, but certainly near enough to that lofty ideal. My dad, he said that the society was looking for the compass that led us to you. The girl and man were Bethina's creation, an attempt to create an army of followers. She used them... Oh, she used them well and we killed many during the war, but they were simply creatures, innocent. They knew nothing, or not what they did. Of course, we couldn't contain Piazzolla's existence. It drifted down to the general public and the girl and man were a part of everyday life. We had only one choice, erased. We erased as many memories as possible, as much evidence as possible, but it seems the story remained in some people's hearts, that the only explanation for the legend's existence, oh, well, that's the only explanation, and the Goa men were driven out. With no one able to remember where they came from, the people gave, up, gave way to fear and hatred and drove the Goa men out. But that still doesn't explain, I was not as optimistic as Glibo, I didn't, didn't believe in Bethina's death as readily as he. In the event of her return, the compass would lead the Goa Man here to safety, and hopefully limit her power. The society must have discovered the compass, and something of importance. Your father was sent to monitor the society, we weren't sure of their motives, but eventually they won your father's trust. My guess is they intended to wipe out the Goa Man and look for the compass in the rubble. You hired my father to keep tabs on the society's actions. It was there he met you, Crawler, and to be honest, we weren't sure whether we should trust you either. Hey! She lives, like us, though her extended hibernation suggests to me that she was considerably weaker than she once was. This is something you should all be very thankful for. And now it seems she is attempting to rebuild the device that this Cleo Neo is helping her. But Pia Solar was destroyed when the castle collapsed and if the plans are gone then they are irrelevant. Her intellect was unsurpassed. Without the help of Pia Solar, 
Um, now her memory has no end. The plans exist within her. You saw elements of my own design on Cleoneo's transporter. I don't doubt there was a message. She was taunting me. We can assume that the prototype has already been finished. Then it's too late. It is not. There was a failsafe built into the original. Three crystals. All of which need to be used in order to activate the device. So that's what she was talking about when we found Rudy. The last three things missing to complete the machine were these crystals. So we destroy the crystals. Absolutely not. They are your insurance. You need them to stop Pierce Solar from activating. In the event that plan A fails, that is. And plan A is, you must destroy Bethina. And how do we know it's not you we should destroy? I don't know why I couldn't read that. We should be more concerned with the situation at hand. Which one is that? That we're okay with murder and just trying to figure out who's worthy of it? There is no time to discuss this further. If I sought the power of Pierce Solar, I certainly wouldn't be revealing this all to you now. Enough. I recall is right. He's explained himself, and it is clear that Pierce Solar can't be rebuilt. No one wants her dead more than me. I want to make her pay for what she did to my dad, but we are not murderers. Whatever Aracol's motive is in killing Bethina, it's his own. We'll find the crystals and prevent the machine from being used, and then we'll destroy it. We can bring Bethina to justice alive. That's right, Huston. Child, your virtue is admirable, but your wisdom is not nearly as developed. And before we take this any further, there is something else. Huston, Alina, Edisert. It's your right to know. The three architects, Clibo, Bethina, and I, you are completely linked to us much more than you could ever imagine. What are you saying? I assume this hasn't yet crossed your minds, but all three... But all of you resemble... Wait, all the resemblance the three of you have in common with one of us. Those were not just vain, a vain coincidence. Yes, go on. You children are the heritage. All three of you descend from the architects. What? Hoston, your blood is the same blood that flowed in Clibo's veins. Your spirit of leadership reminds me of him. Clippo was a man with determination. What? That's insane. What about Cleoneo? Is it true? Is he my brother? My father said so, but it is absurd. My dad and Bethina? Yes, Huston, your father did not lie to you. Cle Cleoneo is your blood. Your blood brother. The son Rudy never met, but Bethino is... Uh, Bethina? Bethino. Is not Cleoneo's real mother. She uses him. She is interested in his heritage. Just like you, Huston, Cleoneo comes from Clibo. Adopting him was her way to hold on... Or to hold to Clibo's generation. She never told Cleoneo the truth. He is blind, and I'm afraid he's helpless. Despite the miserable relationship... I've always had with Myrto, I guess I'm lucky. My life could have been much worse. Alina, your ancestor clearly carries strong genes. Have you wondered why you were able to interact with ancient portals and artifacts? You look like her when she was young. No, no, it can't be. Bethina? Bethina is my ancestor? After all my life secretly dwelling on my real family. That's what the future has for me? Bethina? I'm very sorry you feel this way. Alina, I know you have reasons to do so, however, Bethina used to be a different creature. She was kind and brave. Believe it or not, she had a compassionate heart. Besides her bright intelligence, she was deceived by the idea of power. You can see... Oh, is it I can see? Something can see. The traits you've inherited from Bethina were only her virtues, unlike Cleoneo, who, although does not carry Bethina's blood, turned into her blind follower. Wait a moment, Aracol... So does that mean that you and I, we are part of the same family lineage? Yes, it is. I never thought I'd ever say this to anyone, but I'm glad. Wow, that was unexpectedly odd. However, I'm glad as well. At least, someone is capable of understanding my passion for gadgets and screws and inventions and... and your weird taste for mascot names. I hope this compensates my... my connivance with the past. I hope you understand I had my reasons to be negligent before. But that is now also part of the past. I just lost my father. I couldn't do anything to save him. But to simply set out on a quest to kill Bethina, I won't betray his memory by any by being anything less than the person he would want me to be. What we need to do is to find a way to neutralize Piazzola. That will end the source of her power. Hoston. Agreed. Hoston. Uh, agreed, Hoston. This device is obviously dangerous, but we have to be cautious. I recall. Yes. We need the crystals. I do not have them. I've entrusted mine to Sarit, a friend and intern, if you will. There were a couple that assisted us in the project. I brought him with me when I abandoned the, that other world. He's rather reclusive, though, and eccentric. You'll find him on an island nearby. He's a true friend, I assure you. It's safe there. 
I'll send him word that you're coming. You're not coming with us? No, before Pia Sola was destroyed, Bathina crafted her own dimension. I imagine that it still exists and that... And it's likely... It remains her base of operation. We'll need a, mo a modus of travel. I'll begin its construction, bring my crystal back to me, and we'll find the second one with Clibbo. Where is he? Nowhere accessible by modern vehicles. Another dimension. One of his own. We'll go there together, I'm sure he'll assist us. There we can find the second, for it is interested to him. So, how do we get to this island? Mosa can help you with that, however, I'll need the young one's help. Me? Yes, you. You underestimate your brilliance, child, and if we want this to happen quickly, I'll need an extra pair of hands. Okay. Come now, we have no time to waste. Mosa, please make the preparatives for their trip. Certainly. Oh. Wait, so I lose out, Edison? Aww. Hmm. Right, it's so weird without him. Do I, like, literally not have Edison with me? Hmm. I am. I'm down to a four party team. That sucks. Either way, it's been nearly three hours. This has been the longest session I've done of Pierce Olaf, but it's been fun. We've actually advanced the game a lot, and also advanced the plot and everything. So that's cool. Either way, that's going to be the end of this session. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. And until next time, take care.